There was a time when humans and creatures of magic lived in harmony. Werecats, known as Felices, had married human women. But one day, the harmony broke, and the war began. The world was split into two realms. The kingdom of the Felices, and the land of the humans. Determined to banish magic, the humans overthrew their gods, and they outlawed magic and magic creatures. In spite of this, love arose to take the place of hate, and life defeated death. Eveline, the daughter of a hunter, fell in love with a werecat, the sworn enemy of the humans. Their love was a crime. What lies ahead for our characters? What hand has fate dealt them? In time, you will know everything. For now, a young couple has met secretly in the thick of the Forbidden Forest. You're not exactly master of choosing places for our dates, are you? I was barely able to find the path. I chose this place for a reason. Do you see that tree stump? A little dragon will appear there soon. Really? i never seen a dragon. My father and the hunters killed the last one. No, they didn't. If you tame a baby dragon, it will be your faithful helper. Come closer. Silver, I must clean the wound as soon as possible. won't think to search my cabin. Mm-hmm. <sighs> 
strange. Father never said he fought the Felices, even though he told me about the war. Why did he hide this from me? Strange. Father never said he fought the Felices, even though he told me about the war. Why did he hide this from me? Feel better? Aurelio. Evelyn, are you okay? Did that monster hurt you? He's not a monster! How can you say that? Evelyn, it's a Feliz! A beast! A wild creature from the Forbidden Forest! You don't know anything about Aurelio! I love him! And... we're engaged! What are you talking about? My daughter? The daughter of the chief hunter is going to marry a weir cat. I've never heard of anything more shameful. Father, I love you, but I've made up my mind and you can't change it. Evelyn, you disgrace me. statue portrays how man has subdued the wild heart of nature. The townspeople are proud of it. Storm, who goes there? Entering the Forbidden Forest is prohibited. We only allow those with a pass to continue beyond this point. It's Francis' daughter. I don't care who her dad is. No card, no way.
Hard-working guards. Frost told me to give you this rum as a reward for your diligent service. I hope Father won't punish them, but I had no choice. I have to find Aurelio. Even worse. I must save him somehow. What? Is he dead? No. He's breathing. But he's lost a lot of blood.
Help! Help me! There's a young man, a Feliz. He's badly injured. A hunter shot him with a silver bullet. Do something, please. A Feliz? It's been a long time since I've seen one of their kind. Fortunately, I know what to do. There's a potion that can heal his wound, but making it is beyond my powers. Only one who loves him can make it. Here you are. Take the potion recipe and this pot. This is no ordinary pot, as you can make potions in it without a fire. Think of it as your birthday present for me. How do you know about my birthday? I just know certain things, Eveline. Now hurry, find the ingredients you need and make the potion. Feel free to use anything in the hut. That's where I feed my pet raven. He's a picky eater. He only likes berries. Father has lied to me since I was a child. So whose daughter am I? No, this can't be true. If it is, Father has lied to me since I was a child. So whose daughter am I?
How could this be? My father, the beloved man who raised me, he adopted me. Why did he hide this from me? Not only that, but he lied about the Felices. That creature was protecting me. I wonder, is my life somehow connected to these amazing beings?